All right, full screen. Okay. <clears throat> hey, welcome back. This is Ninja Maker. I'm back at the game with the gaming. I'm jumping back into Aeon Must Die. I know it's been a very long time since I touched this game because I've been uh, busy with working and doing art and like doing other games, such as playing this game right here. This is a very awesome game. <clears throat> but yeah, I'm joining back into this game. And I'll be honest, uh, I was kind of missing it for a bit. So let's do it. I love that loading screen. All right. Move on. The flame within. Together, Aeon and his hosts have come a long way. Before they meet with Ivory, they must settle or set aside their difference. Oh, shit. For centuries, I sought out the strongest in existence. I believe power was the only path respect and yet it has all turned out different look it's him our, our Aeon it doesn't matter we need to stop him or kill laugh kill or uh, <laughs> my own generals held little reverence for me for my power, they plotted and schemed behind my back. And now Ivory's generals portray her too. Her compassion is disregarded, just the same as my power. Well, he doesn't notice us. What do we do? No quiet moment. Have there ever been? We can speak later. I already know what you feel, what you want. Keep your platitudes and concerns for another. Aeon, Aeon, stop being boring, you piece of shit. Pay attention, Aeon. I see you, fool. So how would you like me to shut that mouth for you? Brothers, get it together. He sees us. Let's send them all. Righteous and... Die. Die like the scum you all are. Alright. Let's do it. Writing segment. Look at me. You'll have to repeat that Holy shit, that was loud. Come here. Yeah, yeah. Let's go. Hmm. 
every step of the way I've pushed you. And now, again, when we're near the end, remember, Ivory desires to speak with you again. She doesn't want this. She asked for gen asked her generals to bring you to her. And they betrayed that order. I don't care what she desires. She has to be. And don't pretend to care for her. It's Nebula you want. Aeon, look at all we've been through. Talk about it. There has to be another way to get what you want. I'm tired of you, Star Spawn. My patience is at an end. Thus far, you have enjoyed my lineage. And now you will face my wrath. Cannot be. Boy, take you, Star Spawn. Again, we fight again. I've had it with your insolence. No, we'll go to her together. Do what you must. But no, there are always other options. Chapter complete. United with diversity. At the heart of his pantheon, Aeon faces Ivory's new general. Each is loyal to her in her their own way. This will not be easy. At last, Pantheon, the heart of my empire, the place Ivory believes will shield from my wrath of fatal no further we meet again Aeon with respect I will cherish this final encounter grown a backbone this time have you last time we met you ran away with your tail between your legs some sacrifices are necessary even if it only slowed you down, it was worth it. Just like old times. My lovely Aeon and stars, how wonderful to see you again. In the heat of battle too, I'll make sure to keep the Armada busy, so make this one burn for me, won't you? Scarlet, don't stand against your queen. Fight with me, we must keep her safe. I can handle this well in the Armada myself, Scarlet. But you have my gratitude. I'll gladly burn this one to ash. I ask you for the final time. Will you turn away? Leave Ivory alone. A witless question. And a foolish question. Why should I turn back? More so, why would I listen to one who betrayed me and now betrays her? Ivory, she is more than just a commander, more than just my queen. I cannot fathom existence without her, so if there is even the slightest chance you might kill her, I can't let you pass. Alright. This won't be easy. Get out. Stay 
Boom. Come on. Oh. out alive if not for his deluded birth. even in betraying her they put their lives on the line well Dante I should have killed you while I had the chance but you run away and left your dogs to do the dirty work do the dirty work is that a typo? <laughs> How did you not see I wanted you to die as safely as possible? What worse fate for an emperor than to perish at the hands of Prey's fanatical dog? Now you take. Oh, no, no, no. Now your patience, Aeon. We come to offer aid. While you deal with this pathetic insult to exist in her primitive decision, we assure you the Armada will not interfere. Onyx, I figure I owe the Star Spawn a little for sparing your life. Have your taste of divinity and smite anyone that attempts to. Lord, Onyx, so you turn on, on us as well. I'll come for you once Aeon's head is on a pike. I'll crush you too. We have such fire in the face of certain death. Certainly, it is our interest. Alas, we shall be unable to act. You will perish. Why do you continue to be so brazen? Or brazen? Is it because I abandoned that doctrine you clung to for comfort? You betrayed us all, and then she didn't even finish the job. So, I stuck with the Armada. I made, made it my purpose to strip you of all pride, to dishonor you, and to kill you myself. I may have turned on a doctrine, but you? You betrayed the very being you claimed to honor and follow. You sickened. 
then let's end that, shall we? Goodbye, Aeon. Your legacy ends here. Was too close. That was fucking awesome. After Dantheos and Moran, I would be free of the feeble pawing of the insect. State your name. I am Cray, journal to Ivory, and the farthest your rebellion will reach. Aeon, know that what I do is for my own convenience, not because I owe you or the stars on my life. Show me this other path we spoke of. He spoke and then i will decide don't come and patronize me while you still cling to your beliefs ash go hold off this fool's agent while i deal with him we'll speak later ash you're helping him i was told you'd gone mad in your search for the truth it seems the stories were true as you wish aeon but we will speak later now silence this one. He knows not when to listen, making demands in the face of the inevitable. It will be done, in Ash. It sickens me to say that, but I appreciate your hope. Gray, was it? How have I never heard of you? Pantheos and Moran held it, but you seem to have stood back until now. Those fools, one too brash, the other too emotional. Neither clever enough for anything more complicated than charging right at me. I was smart enough. Smart enough to not resist Ivory when she took over. Her shadow let me make my grab for power. She believes she commands the Armada, but she doesn't. I do. Another traitor. It seems honor has abandoned my armada. Do none of you respect your commanders, your rulers? What did you expect from centuries of war? Of taking the strongest as our hosts? We all crave power, Aeon. I will be the one to seize it. Ivory is the guiding star, our symbol. She managed to reign in the armada, and that lets me control the it lets me rule from the shadow. I will not let you change that. Stand aside, and I'll cherish the last few moments of absolute control you get once I deal with it. Consider it a gift. No, thank you, Aeon. There is no other way. This universe cannot have two emperors. <laughs> And it's like, move, bitch. 
Let's go. Oh boy. I think I might complete this game tonight. Ooh. Disintegration warhead. Press X during grab while in overheat. Force her flames into an, an opponent. Create an overheated living grenade. Ends overheat. Yeah. Where it all begins. Where it all begins. And where it will end. Each has their own And each their own goal. Will the voice of hope reach out? Or will it will everything burn? There she is. It's good to see you again, my Aeon. Show the pleasant truth. Don't pretend like things have changed between us. I'm not. You may not believe it, but I did miss you. Correcting your mistakes has been tiring. My mistakes? You betrayed me! Took everything! My body! My power! My throne! What I did may have been... What I did may have been of anger, even pettiness, but I don't regret it. Where is she? I am here, my love. Talking is hard, but... I have waited for you. She lingers still, Stars. No, not for long. You let Aeon's rage delay you far too long. Don't let her deceive you, Star Spawn. Even at the end, the coward denies her own treachery. No, even if we are at odds, I understand everything. We want the same for our own. I know you care, Stoss, but her sacrifice is needed for the salvation of time. I'm sorry. She's not going to reason with us, no matter how hard you try. Ivory is bound to the doctor. As you should have been, but instead you let your empire collapse. You turn on your own kind. Enough! Starspawn! We must stop her. Forgive me. 
pedo. Oh, she got cake. You struck first again, and again you failed. What more am I to do? You continue to leave me with no choice. Then stand down and let me burn you like the rot you are, so I may free my empire of your poison. Me? It started with you. You got so drunk on power, so lustful for it, that it imprisoned you. You broke your promises. Turn on the void. I hope you had learned by now. In your error. I wanted to see the Aeon. We had all followed without question. But I see he died long ago. Give her back. I can't, Darcy. I need her. Please, hold Aeon back. Help me save my own. Is she all you care for, Starspawn? You will let her take all we have worked for? The two of you strive for the same goal, but to different ends. I wish I, would give her, I could give her back. But she won't. There is no other path. Not all of us wish to fight. I want an Aeon back. You want Nebula back. He can't forgive me. Nebula understands, but does not wish to be sacrificed for me. Each wishes to stop the other. I believe that puts us at an impact, doesn't it, dear Osborne? No other one. My love, do what is this? For the life that they are eager to destroy. For the death they love for the void. For all of us. Let the void take us and put us out of our misery. Let the flame never burn. Ah, never blow out. Fire! Ah. 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 
Oh boy. It makes you work your brain. Really? That didn't hit her? Shit. Blah. Yeah. Where am I? Yeah. yeah. are sweaty. Cheap shots now. Out of my way. Okay. I'm safe again. Fire! Fire! 
This again. Oh boy. My love. Now is our chance to fix what went wrong. Quiet. Help me. We can still fight. Aeon must not succeed. No. It's our chance, Star Spawn. Finish her. Don't hesitate. No. Star Spawn. No. We're not killing anymore. What do you wish to leave behind, Aeon? Death and ruin? Will that be your legacy? Why do you hold me back now, Nebula? You know he'll do it, even with your star spawn re ah, resistance. The Aeon I know is long gone. Don't let him take everything I care for. Don't... Ivory. Don't you feel it? This tug of war between our hosts is fire. So unlike my own, it's not fear. Aeon. Another way. Show me then, Star Spawn. This other way. As Aeon and Ivory clashed, the Starspawn called out to Nebula, burning with a desire and purpose unlike any before. The two stopped in their tracks and Aeon, for the first time in centuries, saw the futility of their struggle and the pettiness of his ambitions. He felt the Starspawn's unyielding purpose and affection for Nebula. Through Nebula and the Starspawn, Aeon at last found a way to let his ambition rest. He Holy. saw Ivory as he had before. Holy shit. The thickness on Ivory, though. <laughs> she saw Aeon of centuries past, and the two reconciled. Knowing that the Void would free him of the desire for power that had so corrupted him, that had become his true prison, Aeon joined the march back into the Void. The passing of Ivory and Aeon into the Void released their hosts from confinement. Reunited once more, Nebula and the Starspawn embraced in an explosion of their bond. The universe burned with blinding light that engulfed all. When the light faded, the pair was gone, seeding the universe with new life. The end of one story, and the beginning of another. Mm, that's nice. Hey! And that, ladies and gentlemen, was Aeon Must Die. So, yo, this beat though, kind of hard. But yeah, uh, this game could have been amazing. Like, I spoke this many, many times before in my previous video. Like, this game had so much potential to be something great. But due to the fact that the game developers were pretty much abused during the development of this game, they were abused, uh, got abused by the limestone company. But they were not given any uh, kind of payment whatsoever did not make any revenue whatsoever due to this game and then um they're making another game uh they made their own company called uh Mishura, Mishura games or whatever and they're making a 
a brand new game that is like very similar to this one. So pretty much it's like they're learning from their mistakes and then just make something super awesome. So yeah, I mean, despite the fact that, you should have remained dead. yeah, despite the fact that this game has like a few bugs and glitches here and there, like it's fire. I mean, I don't know, like I don't mean to be very cliche about it, but this game is literal fire. I mean, there are there are some boss fights that just felt like very jagged, very unorthodox. Especially um the fight with uh, Scarlet and Onyx. Oh my God! Like those fights were kind of unfair, especially Scarlet. That fight was so fucking unfair and so punishable. You know, I feel I feel pretty happy that I was able to beat this game but once more. Like I beat it a few times before, but I just feel very accomplished that I was able to beat this game during recording. I think to our family, to our friends. Family. Oh fuck that! No, like you limestone assholes are you, you're bastards. Every last one of you. <laughs> Yeah, we're, we're, we're pretty done here. And then it brings us back to the very beginning. So this game is pretty much like one giant loop. <sighs> what? How am I here again? Our spawn? Still there, huh? I'm certain we left this pit. So then, why are we here? And why does it feel like you know more? When did I let you access to my ability? I don't know. Fine. It doesn't matter. We have far more important things to deal with. I really will not have my it won't be easy though. My armada is stronger somehow. I can sense it. And it will take every bit of my strength to do it. So don't squander me. What are you doing? <laughs> and that is Aeon Must Die. But yeah, I'm going to go ahead and stop it right here because basically you're just playing the entire game all over. Again, this, this game is one giant loop, like I said. Still, very fun. Very, very fun game. But 
and the game developers despite the fact they did not get like any revenue or that much credit for it they really did this game justice despite its flaws here and there but yeah yeah wow oh i completed a playthrough <laughs> Like, I feel pretty accomplished right now. Oh, yeah. But I'm... Like, I cannot wait for Mishara Games to bring out their new game. Like, I know it might take a bit of a while for the game to develop. But I cannot wait. I believe the game that developing is called Immortal. Like, you can just look it up on YouTube. Like, just type in Mishara Games immortal on youtube and definitely see like the development of the game and you can obviously see that there are some simbi well lots of similarities with that game in aeon must die so yeah yeah i had fun this, this game is fun like this game is always a blast all right all right once again, this is Ninja Maker. Thank you so very much for watching this full gameplay of Aeon Must Die. I'll see you in the next video.